my name is Jason Black. I'm the Irish athlete in Biking Man 2019. I've decided to return to Biking Man. It's my third Biking Man, and uh, the reason I've decided to return is this year's series takes me to brand new countries, to countries I've never had an opportunity to go to before in my life. And for me, as an adventure athlete, it's all about uh, meeting people and it's always about experiencing new cultures, new uh, religions, new food, uh, new geography, new terrain, new mountains, new rivers, new roads, and just discover the world. And for me, returning to Oman and returning to Corsica, getting an opportunity to go to Laos, uh, getting an opportunity to go to Peru, to uh, Taiwan and Portugal, I've never, uh, I've never had an opportunity to travel to these countries before, and for me, that's the exciting part about uh, going to uh, Biking Man, uh, taking on the Biking Man series, and also as well, they just don't do it in, or in any ordinary way. They take you to the most remote environments, the most remote roads, the steepest climbs, the hardest terrains, the toughest environments. And for me, as an adventure athlete, that's what I enjoy the best. So, because the, the series is the World Unsupported Championship, and as, a, as an athlete and as a competitor, I'm always here to, to be the best that I can be, and to be a winner. So, in Oman, I've finished second overall behind Rodney, and I'm lying second overall in the World Championship. But winning isn't everything for me, it's participation, it's taking part, it's being the best that I can be on that particular day, that particular race, that particular moment. And I suppose I went to Oman to win and I had a really good race. Uh, myself and Rodney and Josh Libet had a fantastic race. And unfortunately since Oman I've had devastating um, circumstances at home with the loss of a very close brother-in-law and it was a very extreme situation there's a lot of tragedy a lot of sadness and I haven't been able to focus properly on preparing for Corsica it's been a very challenging time mentally and physically at home uh, with my wife and my sister who lost her partner and their four children so I've really come to Corsica to to find peace um, to connect spiritually uh, on my bike, to have no distractions. Am I here really to race? Well, I suppose as an athlete I am, but is it my primary focus? No, it's not. Um, my focus really is to get back in tune with my life and to find peace with the tragedy that's happened and to try to make sense of it. And I'm going to use this race, this event, to do that. So it's going to be me my bike, Mother Nature, and my last one. For the last two years, I've been a global ambassador for the Irish Red Cross, the humanitarian support network globally that supports communities and countries that have fallen on hard times due to natural disasters beyond their control. The Irish Red Cross is the longest serving um, peacekeeping service in the world and it's something we take very serious as Irish ambassadors, as Irish people, that if we can help other people in difficult circumstances, uh, that is our responsibility and duty and it's the greatest gift in the world is to be able to make a difference in another person's life. So for me when I get an opportunity to travel globally, whether it's through my mountaineering life or through my adventure life, I try to connect with the communities and countries that we've had a connection with and uh, just to document the recovery and to liaise with the communities look both uh, from a public perspective and from a, a political perspective and uh, just to make make them aware that we care as an Irish society and that we really hope that their recovery is, is speedy and that we've played a, a vital role in that uh, contribution. So the next race, uh, after we finish with Corsica, we've got a very quick turnaround. So within 10 days, I'm off to Laos um, in the Southeast uh, Asia. Um, you know, I've never been there before. It's a, a country I really want to connect with. I'm super excited about the culture, 
Um, I'm super ex excited about meeting the people, experiencing the food, uh, experiencing how they live their life, uh, the good, the bad and the different. Um, the wonderful thing about having the opportunity as an adventure athlete to travel is that it keeps me very grounded. I have a great understanding of, of how other people in more desperate situations are happy and that it keeps me grounded that I'm thankful for everything that I have. Um, I'm thankful that I've got a healthy body, a healthy life. Um, I'm thankful that I have an opportunity to travel the world and to race and to meet these incredible people. And uh, sometimes the, the, the travels teach me that uh, I meet people in, in more worse and dire situations than I've ever been in. And at times they've got nothing and they've got everything and we've got everything and sometimes I think we've got nothing. So adventure travel teaches me so much about a human being and, and, and the grounding and the galvanization that, uh, that we only drink from this cup of life once. And if it's true that we only ever drink from this youthful cup of life once, well then I want to drink it to its full. And I want to really enjoy life, I want to really enjoy people, I want to really enjoy the gift that I was given as an adventure athlete. And I really want to make a difference in other people's lives. We get the opportunity to meet the most incredible people. Um, some are full-time professional athletes competing at the highest level. Uh, in their sport. Uh, some are participating just to get to the finish line. Uh, we all have our own personal goal, goals within Biking Man. The people in the community of people, both in the organization and the athletes, are incredible. We seem to be made from the same, from the same type of material. We actually want to care for each other. We're very competitive as athletes. We want to be the best that we can be. But we don't want to do that at every cost or at anybody else's expense. So we all care about each other's welfare, we all care about each other's participation, we all want each other to do well, we all want each other to be the best athletes that we can be. And we always support each other both on and off the race. And that's very important. Um, Biking Man is special, Biking Man's different. Um, the exploration and the empowerment to engage with people and allow people to be themselves. Biking Man allows people to set goals and have dreams and aspirations and, and, and set tough courses that really challenges them physically and takes them mentally to somewhere that's uniquely special and they'll never experience it in any other type of an adventure. So uh, Biking Man for me is a very special environment. It's a very special opportunity to find out more about Jason Black.